You know, I just wanted to spend some time with my son playing Fortnite this morning before we go to this vegan food festival. But Thomas, no, mental illness is not an excuse to be a dick. What is up everybody? This is Chris from The Rewired Soul, where we talk about the problem, but focus on the solution. And if you're new to my channel, my channel's all about mental health. And we got some influencers out here who are being a bad influence on the mental health community. So I make videos about that stuff. If you're into that, make sure to subscribe and ring that notification bell. So yeah, this is gonna be a short, simple video. So I just made a different video about Thomas Halbert. A bunch of you already watched it. But anyways, in that video, I mentioned that all of you and Thomas needs this book called Unfuck Your Adulting, all right? Look at this chapter right here. Can you guys see that? Can you see that? I don't know if the camera's getting it. It says, don't be a dick, okay? Don't be a dick, all right? Like, this is something that Tristan and I were just talking about the other day. But anyways, let me just catch you up to speed. Um, I made this video about Thomas and tough love, but trying to be nice, but now I'm gonna be a little bit more tough. Like, Tristan and I were talking like, I recently had to get somebody out of my life because they have a mental illness and they're just a jerk all the time. And that's not an excuse. That is not an excuse for anybody. And Thomas tweeted out, like he retweeted somebody that said mental uh, health is not an excuse. And he retweeted it and says, yes it is. No, it is not. And like, I have to make this video because I know how many of you watch my videos and everything and like, I talk about mental health, I talk about being a better person, I talk about getting out of the problem and into the solution. And we cannot have this dude out here saying mental health is an excuse for your poor behavior. It is not, it is never going to be, all right? This hurts everything that we're trying to do when it comes to increasing awareness and decreasing the stigma. There is a world of people out there who thinks that we use our mental health as an excuse for poor behavior. So when you got this guy, when you got this guy over here who has hundreds of thousands of subscribers, even though he just lost 30,000, who is saying mental health is an excuse, that is not cool. That is not okay. I am never, ever, ever going to defend any of you if you try to use mental health as an excuse. I work with addicts and alcoholics all the time. They used to call me and say, oh, well, duh, 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 I had to drink, I had to use, I had to do this. Uh, like, there's no valid excuse. They would blame their mom, they would blame their dad, they would blame this, they would blame that. No, no excuse. Your mental health is your responsibility. I've mentioned in other videos, like I have a diagnosed generalized anxiety disorder. When I get anxious, I get very snippy. I get very snippy, really just, Ugh, I can be a dick, all right? And that's not cool. That's not fair to my son. That's not fair to my girlfriend, Tristan. That's not fair to all of you. That's not fair to my clients. That's not fair to the rest of the world. So what do I gotta do? I have to keep it under control. That is my responsibility. So that is why I work so hard on my mental health, okay? Like, the analogy I always give, the analogy I always give is imagine somebody in a wheelchair just love to roam around running over people's feet, right? Like, imagine that. And imagine him, him or her just being like, well, I'm in a wheelchair, I get to do that. No, you would look at that person in the wheelchair and say, no, you're a dick. Being physically ill is not an excuse to be a dick. Same thing with mental health. Mental health is not a valid excuse to be a dick, okay? A long time ago, I made a video about Kanye West when he made his album talking about his bipolar disorder. It is not an excuse. Like, you guys, there aren't many mental illnesses out there that make you into a bad person, all right? Like, it might distort some of your clarity and all of that, but most people with mental illness are able to work on themselves and get logical and have compassion and empathy and all of those things. So like, for example, with the whole Shane Dawson series and you saw all of the backlash about them talking about sociopathy and all of that and saying, oh, they don't have feelings, they don't have empathy and all that, and people were like, no, they do have feelings, they do have empathy. So then you've got this kid Thomas out here who's trying to act like the mental illness that he's struggling with is get, making it so he doesn't understand how people feel. Come on, Thomas. Come on, you're better than that. But again, my videos aren't about Thomas. Thomas, again, if you watch this video, I'm, I'll send a free copy your way. But this is for all of you. This is for all of you. You have no justifiable excuse to be a bad person. And I'm just getting that out of the way, all right? So anyways, sorry for this very short, 
rant style video. If you like it, thumbs up. If you don't, thumbs down. If you want to, subscribe. Thank you to everybody supporting the channel over on Patreon. I got some other cool videos coming up soon, so make sure you subscribe, ring the notification bell. I love you all, and quit using these things as an excuse, and don't be a dick.